Hello and welcome to Darkside Scenics. In this video I'll be showing you how I made these model hedges. These photos show the result I'm looking for. You can see the structure of the hedge while still being able to see through it. When creating the diorama baseboard I made sure the hedge areas were raised. Using a 2mm drill bit, I drilled random holes along the raised area. The drilling makes quite a mess, so I just hoover up the fibre mould. I'll deal with the white areas later. These twigs are from a dead thyme plant and I just cut them to the required length. There will be some trees within the hedges and for those I'm using sea foam. I'm just giving them a light spray with brown Humbrol acrylic paint. Using layering spray I build up the trees using a variety of scatters and leaves. The shades of the scatter are quite similar, so the differences between the trees and the hedges will be quite subtle. Using scenic glue, I add the trees to the raised area. Using the time twigs I cut earlier, I'm dipping them into scenic glue and then inserting them into the pre-drilled holes. When the basic structure is complete, I sprinkle some earth texture over the top to cover the holes. A light spray of washing up liquid and water is used before adding scenic cement to hold everything in place. For the next part of the hedge I'm using rubberized horsehair cut into thin strips. The base is quite condensed so I'm removing that section. I want the hedge to be quite messy so I gently pull apart the horsehair until I'm left with enough pieces.
colour is what I'm looking for, so I'm coating everything with brown acrylic spray paint. The next step is to use the same layering spray and scatters I use for the trees. I brush up scenic glue onto the twigs before adding the horse hair. The great thing about the twigs is it really helps to hold the horsehair in place. I keep adding the different sections and take a bit of time to ensure everything's in place. I cut some small pieces of sea foam and again use similar scatters from before. The sea foam is used to add a variety of bushes along the hedge. Looking from the side of the hedge, this is the effect I was hoping for. I created some flowers to add just under the hedge and throughout the lane. I make the flowers slightly longer than required because I use a scalpel to insert them into the diorama. Finally, I use some earth weathering powder to add some tracks to the lane. I took the diorama to Ashburnton and Dittisham to take the final photos. 